Northwest Perennial Alliance border, and we had a request from Peggy asking about her heucheras and how to cut them back. So today we found a suitable victim, though not terribly overgrown, that we can work on. So what Peggy had asked about was that her heuchera had gotten quite stemmy and was starting to fall over and grow, and good for you, Peggy, that you still have one that's actually growing. Um, so what you want to do is just get down in there, and you can cut them back pretty hard, and you're just cutting off the stem. Of course, it can have a much longer dead brown part of stem on it. This also gives you a chance to get in there and see how the clump is doing and look for any damage from vine weevils or rabbits or anything like that. You don't have to cut all of them off. I'm just cutting the worst of them off. Like that old big one there. And what you can do is then just clean down all the dead leaves, any flower stems, and pretty much any of the fully expanded leaves. You can leave a few little ones. Okay, and you'll notice that it is sort of dead in the middle. Cut it back until it's nice and firm and not dead in the middle. Then you go ahead and plant this in a reasonably moist, shady location until it roots, and then plant it out in your garden. So don't worry about hacking back your heuchera and cutting it back hard, because it will regrow, and in a few months, probably by fall in this case, you'll have a nice, lower, cleaner mound of foliage again to enjoy.